In a poignant moment of resilience and duty, Prince William recently undertook his first overnight trip since the public revelation of Princess Catherine's cancer diagnosis. This journey, significant both personally and professionally, marks a delicate balancing act between his royal obligations and his role within his family during this challenging time. Prince William is feeling very relaxed about his decision to travel overnight, a first for the Prince of Wales since his wife was diagnosed with cancer. William set out to the southwest of England Thursday to visit the Duchy of Cornwall's housing project focused on helping homelessness. The trip, centered around visiting various charities and community projects, was designed to underscore the royal family's ongoing commitment to their public roles, despite personal trials. The visit included stops at several initiatives that focus on mental health and support for underprivileged youth, causes that are close to Prince William's heart and have been central to his and the Prince's charitable work for many years. Royal expert Ian Pamham told, Homeward the Charity for Homeless People is very much at the heart of what William wishes to drive forward and in reality is only a short flight away if Catherine had any sudden issues. Obviously, William feels that Catherine is on the mend now, and he has been very relaxed leaving London and seen in Cornwall. As the Prince of Wales, he also inherits the Duchy of Cornwall where he is staying overnight in the country. Since the announcement of Princess Catherine's diagnosis, the royal couple has been the focus of widespread public sympathy with messages of support pouring in from around the globe. The princess has been receiving treatment and according to Kensington Palace, is responding well. Throughout this period, the family has expressed their gratitude for the public's compassion and respect for their privacy. Prince William's decision to continue with engagements, particularly an overnight trip, reflects not only a sense of duty, but also a message of strength to those who may be in similar situations. It signals a commitment to continue with life's responsibilities despite personal challenges and serves as an act of solidarity with those facing their own battles against illness. During his trip, Prince William made it to a point to privately meet with families and individuals dealing with severe health issues, sharing experiences and offering support. These moments, though private and away from the public eye, highlight the depth of his empathy and the genuine connection he seeks to foster with the public. Furthermore, the Prince visit serves as a platform to bring attention to the invaluable work done by healthcare providers and charitable organizations. By engaging directly with these groups, he not only lends his support but also highlights the critical needs and issues faced by communities, thus mobilizing more resources and attention towards them. In his public addresses, Prince William did not shy away from referencing his personal Personal situation. Albeit subtly, he spoke of the strength found in communities and families and the power of support and resilience. His presence and the words were a testament to his personal commitment to his roles as both a national figure and a family man. The prince said he first learned about homelessness when he visited shelters with his mother, Princess Diana, when he was 11. Like his mother, William became a patron of the Centerpoint charity in London. In 2009, he joined its sleep out in London. Last year, on his 40th birthday, he sold copies of The Big Issue, which supports the homeless on the streets of London wearing a baseball cap. As Prince William continues to balance his public duties with his private commitments to family health and well-being, his actions during this trip have resonated strongly with many. They underscore the royal family's role not only as figureheads but as a individuals who face personal challenges and confront them with dignity and courage. As the Prince and Princess of Wales navigate this difficult period, the support from the public and the strength they display are likely to remain closely followed by many both in the UK and internationally. The future engagements of Prince William and potentially the Princess of Wales, depending on her health, will continue to be a beacon of their commitment to their public life and personal 